Hello, hello, hello. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. What's up? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? How's your day so far? Everything okay, teacher. Everything it's okay? Okay. Great. Well, what's new today? What sure. was what was new today or what was interesting? Uh the weather. The weather? Yes. Really? Is it nice? It's nice. Maybe 20 degrees. 20 degrees. Yes. Yeah, that's that's cool. It's very windy in San Salvador. Really? Yeah. Windy and dry. Sometimes cold. Right now it's a little bit cold. I guess it's going to be a cold night. That's good. Okie dokie. How many are we? We are 11 so far. Okay, tonight we're just going to start um, doing the attendance and just moving on with the class. We're not going to wait too long for the rest of your classmates. So we can have more time to have conversations among each other. So let's do it. Um, Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Doris. Doris, can you hear us? Yes. Always say present, please. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Good. Erika Beatriz Lopez Morales. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chávez. Fredis Vladimir Cortés López. I'm here, teacher. Okay, Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Amos Alfredo Garcia Granadino. Hi, teacher, I'm here. Blanca, okay. Josué Alfred, I'm sorry, Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Thank you. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Thank you. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. Here. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Arellana. Present. Suleima Ivón Moreno de Hernández. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Present, teacher. Good evening. Okay. Good evening. I am here, teacher. Sorry yep. for the day. Here. I'm here. My so, background is not working. Um, I can hear you well now. So if, now it's just. It's working now. Okay. Okay, guys, don't forget. Hey, Irwin, welcome. Don't forget to turn on your camera, show your face, try to focus your face in the middle of the screen. Because if they do an audit, they will not recognize your forehead, you know. Come on. Have your full name on your screen as well. Okay. 
as usual, we're gonna start again with the dynamic of banking questions, but this time I'm not gonna split you. I'm just gonna go randomly choosing people and making questions, okay? Okay, so I'm gonna start from my right. Edwin Alexander Alerazo. What is the first thing you do in the morning? What is the very first thing you do in the morning? Um, uh, typically in the morning, I wake up and the first thing that I do is drink water. Drink water. How many glasses? Yes. Uh, just one glass because I read that if you drink one glass of water when you wake, wake up, uh, it's very good for health. For your health. You, for your health, yes. Mm -hmm. So that's the first thing that I do every day. You know, I do the same thing, but I drink two two glasses of water and, and I also drink two, oh, how do you say, uh, garlic tooth, garlic teeth. Yeah, I drink two oh. garlic teeth. Oh, that, that is better. You're blessing because you can drink two a cup of waters but actually i can't i don't know why i actually i feel like throwing up if i if i drink, if you drink too, too much water mm. yeah, if i drink too much water exactly. that's weird that's weird yeah i know okay. but but i think one one cup uh one cup of water is good you know <laughs> a cup of water a cup of water okay great job okay. thank you next okay. stefania reyes Hi. What kind of old person do you want to grow up to become? What kind of old person do you want to grow up to become? Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't want to be old, actually. <laughs> it's reality. We are all going to be old one day. Well, teacher. who doesn't know? Who, what? Who doesn't know? Who, who, knows? who knows? You don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. Oh, of course, yeah. Yeah, but let's be positive. Let's pretend that you will be old as me. One day you will be old like me. <laughs> Very old. Oh, um, you want to be I old? I, I don't know. I never, I never asked me that question, so actually I don't know. I, I, I I've know. never been asked. I've never been asked that question. Think about it. Think about it for a minute. What kind of old person would you like to be? You know what? Yesterday something happened to me. I think oh, I didn't tell you. I had to go for a birth certificate for my baby, for my daughter. She's she just turned seven. And the school is asking for a birth certificate. So I went to Alcaldía Municipal de San Salvador in Las Tres Torres, right? Well, I actually pretended to go to Metro Centro at about 2 p.m. Thing is that I walked to the bus stop and there was this old lady. She was very old. And she started the conversation, you know, are, are you waiting for the bus? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> the thing is that we, we, we started talking and she said she needed to take the need for, get the need for her grandson. And, and she was going to Las Tres Torres. And I was like, we don't need the need anymore, right? But she didn't tell me first that it, at first that it was for her granddaughter. The thing is that her grandson, whatever, we, she convinced me basically on the bus, you know, we took La Trenta and I told her, you know what, this, this one stops in Hacienda and goes to Metro Center. So let's go together. And in the way there, she started conversation. I've been living in Canada. I'm 75 years old. I'm Catecumena and I'm Catecumeno too. So we started, you know, getting along, right? And she convinced me to go there, you know, to La Alcaldía in Las Tres Torres. So I went down. It was weird. <laughs> that was weird, but I felt like I felt with my grandma. The thing is that I took her hand, I held her hand all the way. And she was wearing a cane, you know, you know what is a cane? Yeah. So a third leg, she, she said it was a third leg. The thing is that she was very happy, you know, and, and, and talkative. 
I said goodbye. She went to Ministerio de Hacienda. I went to La Alcaldía. I was waiting my turn. And then she comes through the, war, through the door. And she was like, are you done already? And I'm like, <laughs> man, she's not going to leave me alone. But <laughs> she waited for me. And, and, and I wanted to go to, to the hardware store in, in Metro Centro. But I, anyways, she convinced me again to come back home with her. And she paid the bus. You know, we walked. We walked to, to Cristobal Colón and we took the bus. I took her. She lives, she's my neighbor, basically. She lives on the other neighborhood right in front of mine in the Constitución. So that was funny. And I thought, man, she's 75. I want to be she's 75 like her. She was very enthusiastic. She was walking enthusiastic along. Enthusiastic and, and a happy old lady, I guess. <laughs> so that's the way you should expect to be. Yeah. Okay. That's the way. I know how I'm going to be. I'm going to be like my grandpa from my mother's. He was, he had no belly, you know, he had no belly. He used to walk every morning and he was always happy. So that's the way we should expect to be. Okay, let's see one more. I still have some more questions. We have 20 minutes. Let's see. Yesenia Yanari. I'm going to my right. Jessica Yanari. I'm sorry. Jessica Yanari. Hmm. <laughs> what is your favorite? What is your favorite day of the year? My favorite day. Uh, holiday. <laughs> what holiday? Uh, Christmas. Like Christmas. Why? Uh, 20, 25, 25th. 25th. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But why? Why 25th know. and not 24th? Because I I wake up late, really late. <laughs> yeah, for that go, you go to bed, you go to bed late and you wake up late. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll take that. Try to elaborate more. Hmm. <laughs> That's not a question for the class. Okay, related to the to the class. Let me see. I have Jocelyn right next to Jessica. So, Josie, if you could start any business, what will it be? If I could start a business, I will maybe create a clothing brand because, I, well, I guess that women's and also men's are really the light clothing well and, and all the people like the clothing so I would like to start that because I guess will be will be okay or maybe um, a restaurant okay yeah I go with that what kind of restaurant Mexican restaurant because I Mexican love that food, kind of food. <laughs> yes Mexican food okay what would be the name Mm, it will be something crazy like, for example, crazy taco, something like that. that. Okay. No, no, my name. Come on. <laughs> Yoshi. Oh. I didn't say Yoshi. I said Yoshi. Ah, okay. <laughs> Yoshi I'm taco. Sorry. Hey, a Yoshi <laughs> dressed up like Mexican with a hat, Mexican hat. That sounds pretty nice. <laughs> okay. 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 Let's see. Sandra. Sandrita. Why me? Hmm. Oh, easy, easy. Sandra, what kind of music do you like to listen to? I like music in English. Uh, for example... Wait, wait, stop. I cannot I, see stop. you. I cannot I'm see sorry. you. <laughs> Move your camera. <laughs> Okay. We don't see you. <laughs> this is all we see you from you. And I was like, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, don't worry. So go ahead. What kind of music do you like to listen to? I like to listen to. 
t-shirt. I like the music is English. Any is in English. Sorry. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, uh, um, music uh, Madonna, uh, Rick Ashley. Rick Ashley. Okay. Mm -hmm. All this. Sorry. All this in English. Yes. All this. Okay. All this. Okay, I like to listen to English music, all this music. Okay, Rick Ashley. That's awesome. Ooh, this is a tough question. Okay, let's make a supposition with. Why not? Uh, Freddy's, Freddy's. If you were invisible for a day, what would you do? <laughs> That's a tricky question. <laughs> something, something that you can say in the class. Okay? Uh, a lot of things. <laughs> I think you have thought about it. Bank. But, but yeah. some do a bank? <laughs> Maybe rob a bank. Rob a bank? Yeah. That that is what I was thinking too. <laughs> Man, how how could you do it? How, how can you steal a bank if you're invisible? Don't you think people is gonna notice the bag of money flo floating? Not really? Yes, but yeah, that's they, true. Will, but I think they will not have any idea that were you. That it was you. Okay. Invisible with green. Screen. Um, well, I guess there are conditions, right? To be invisible, you have to be naked to be invisible. That's the bad part about it. <laughs> you know? Maybe about those um, Cesar Pros, I think, are those those cars that they have the money. Oh, that would be easier. Mm, man, it's difficult. Nowadays, it's difficult to steal a bank. It's not that easy, but yeah, okay. Still in the bank. Okay. <laughs> Let's go with Josue Albert. No, 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 Thelma, Thelma. Thelma, easy. Don't say the teacher, okay? What is something that makes you smile? <laughs> I said smile, not laugh. Okay. What? What is something that makes you smile? What is something? something that makes you smile. Thinking about Celso? <laughs> <laughs> no, it is. Every day. I want to hear actually from you. What is it every day that makes you smile? Something that you know, it's like the first thing every day that goes like mm, anything. That works. <laughs> when, uh, I'm speechless. That's the way you say it. I'm speechless. Uh, I have no words. Yeah. Really? I have some secret. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but I'm, I'm pretty sure it's just anything. You're a very happy person, I know. But I, I have many. <laughs> many things? Just one, the yeah. first one. The first one in the morning. What's the first thing in the morning that makes you smile? <laughs> nope. Okay. Someone wants to answer no, that no, question? No, 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 no. Okay. Uh, you, if if you change, you can change. Okay, let me change the question. <laughs> no problem. Okay, what is your favorite childhood memory? What's your favorite oh. childhood memory? When I was when I was younger. Mm -hmm. Childhood memory. Um, when I, when I, I was 
living in Metapan when I was younger. And, um, and I remember that uh, uh, I have many, many friends at the same age and um, we we play we play softball and one time uh, and uh, <laughs> uh, we played we played it um, uh, soccer. Seek, hide and see. No, 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 no. We played it Arranca uh, heavy, heavy. I remember. Oh, you were uh, playing rude. You were playing rude. Yeah. Okay. And um, what do you say? Quebramos una antena. We broke an antenna. Broke an antenna. Yeah. And any, any neighbor? And uh, and what happened? Uh, she out. She came out? Yes, yes. She came out in the street and and nothing. And she scolded you? No, they she she was angry and angry. Uh, angry? Yes. And um we we are uh, Maldijo, what, what did you say? What, what she is it? Course is, she cursed uh, you guys. She cursed you. She cursed us. us. And mm -hmm. uh, in this moment, I, I had to run quickly in, in our in other houses because our father waiting for us with Our father the was belt, waiting yes with the bell in hand oh my god did it's, he hit you i i received um tunda <laughs> <laughs> for I mean, that. Your, your father punished you your father punished you okay Oh, okay. Hey, Thanks. vocabulary, guys. Vocabulary. Thank you, Thelma. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was a nice story. Okay, so scold. When somebody scold you, it's like, uh, uh, you don't have to do that. You're a bad girl. Okay, cursed you. Yes, that's using bad language. You know, uh, profanity, profanity, uh, swearing, swearing. Okay, swearing. In amazingly, swearing. You know, it's it's together, right? Swearing. Swearing comes from swear. I swear. I swear to God. Okay, I swear. But swearing means the same um, bad words. Using profanity. Using profanity. Okay. One more. Thank you. Where did I? Okay, there it is. Let me see. Uh, huh. Hmm, it is an easy one. And this will be the last one for tonight. Who, do you want to participate, anybody? Anybody who wants to talk? Thank you, Selema. <laughs> you look in the mood. You look in the mood. Do you have any vacation plans coming up? Um, no. Only staying at home, in my home, and playing with my dog. That's it. Sleeping. Yeah. yeah. That's it. That's it. I need That's to rest it. a lot because uh, that weeks uh, was so crazy. Uh, uh, I have a lot of work because um, a partner of my department quit and I have some you activities. Did you absorb? Yeah. Did you absorbed her duties or his duties? 
yeah some of mm -hmm. uh, his duties mm. oh, and boy. the new the new person uh, start uh, the past Monday started yeah I started uh, this week but it, I think it's um, uh, a long time uh, before he uh, can absorb the duties that my old partner had. Excellent. Good job, Suleyma. Nice talking. The new person started last Monday. The last Monday. Uh, last Monday. Don't forget, everybody in this class, the, the, the. When do you use the? I hope you're practicing, guys, because you're going to intermediate six and then you start advance one. Oh my God. And that's a different story, okay? So let's start the class with your topic tonight. Um, let me think, what, I, what was I doing? Oh, yesterday we had an activity, okay? So let's do the activity. Let's start working with the activity. Who wants to start? Now I need your help. I need you to be honest and say, okay, I was with Stefania, Edwin, uh, with Lanka, I was with Josue, and our okay, opinion about, okay, what do you remember about last class? What was, what was it that we were doing? We were creating a? Hi, teacher. Role play. A role, role play. play, right? Don't forget, it's just, three stages basically you know on a conversation and but the most important part is to use reported speech of any kind i'm giving you free will but try to use narrative that's the whole point for you to use uh, reported speech as much as you can okay are you ready or well i don't have a way to actually i do have a way you remember who were your partners your classmates Yeah. Yeah. Only Alexander. Okay. Okay. Let's try something that I never tried because I'm afraid of screwing things up. I'm going to let you choose. What do you see on your, on your screen? Nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. What about now? We feel nothing. Breakup rooms. Oh, yeah. join, join okay. Break. You can select who is going to be your classmate. Can you? Yeah. Free will. Yeah. Free will. Okay. Give it a try, please. Let's see. Just choose some people, you know, to be in your group. There is a use one room. A unique room. Yeah. yeah, it is just wrong. Okay, William, can you try to select some names? Let, I never tried this function. Come on. Really, I've never tried it because I thought it was useless, but I always Come wanted on. to see. I can't just... Uh, uh, can just can. Which choice? The okay, let's see if it does work. So Alexander was with... Yuri and Meet the Alexander. Okay, that's not gonna work. <laughs> okay, let's recreate the groups. Okay, you know what? Let's just practice. Did you actually prepare something? Who prepared the conversation? I, I should have asked that first. I guess anybody. We did actually. Nobody's so, so that we did. You did? No, come on. Okay. Yes, but we can practice. I was with Fernando, Josue, and a lady I didn't remember. That is. Ah, okay. Yes, he mentioned. Okay. So I'm going to assign you manually. Let me see. Okay, Jocelyn, who were your classmates, you said? Josue, Fernando, Josue, Fernando. Y and Doris. Okay, mm -hmm. good. Alexander, who were your classmates? 
Yuri and Sandra. Alexander, Yuri and Sandra. Okay. Fernando, you have good memory. What? You I already... was with Jocelyn. Good, got it. Okay, let me see. Jessica, who were you with? With, uh, with Fernando. Really? With me. Yeah, I think. I don't no. remember. No. You see, I we're remember, old. teacher. Jocelyn. Sorry. We're getting old. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, no, 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 no. You was with me. Do, uh, with me yeah, 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 yeah. Daddy, do you remember? Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 Jessica. Who, a... So, who, who were your classmates? I was in all the groups. That is my secret. That's my secret. An omnipresent. Uh huh. Jessica. Edwin. Edwin. And who? Edwin. Uh huh. And. Thelma. Edwin. Thelma. Edwin. Edwin. Janari. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. I don't remember. I did. So I have Jessica, Thelma, and Edwin. That's and it? Irwin. Yeah, Irwin. And Irwin too. Irwin too. Okay, next group. Uh, Blanca, Stephanie, who were you with? Sorry, teacher. Uh, I was with the Stephania. Okay. <laughs> and I don't remember anyone. Okay. <laughs> Luis. 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 Yeah, and Francisco. Yeah, Luis Francisco. And Francisco, just Francisco, and because Luis is not here. Another person, but I can remember. Uh, I'm name. gonna add Erica to this group, okay, and I'm, yeah, and I'm only missing one more group. Andres, who were you with? I was with Alexander and Sandra and my phone. Okay. Mm -hmm. Freddy, you don't remember who were you with? Okay. Okay, everybody else, just join a group. Amos, Irene, Jarvin, William, and Suleiman, I'm going to add you to the groups. Randomly, so you can practice a little bit before we start. Okay, let's go. Well, well, okay. Do you remember the the conversation that we did yesterday? Yeah, yeah. And this is not a commercial. Mm -hmm. I don't want this to be a commercial, but there is this a famous place where you drink coffee in El Salvador and um, they're selling these things, you know. They're awesome. Look, look. I used to go <laughs> frequently look, look. when I was there is a, working there... outside. Really? There's a lock here. And if you activate it, where it doesn't come out. I have Even I received that as a gift. I have yeah. a, a bottle like that, yeah. but this I bought in I bought gold. The, the gold brown. In in gold where, yes, when you can buy some bags or some Oh, bags. oh no 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 this is gold. actually better. I don't know. I liked it. Okay. Come on. Let's do it. The role play. I'm not here. <clears throat> okay. Yes, you are. <laughs> okay. Remember, we talked about yesterday that uh, Jose will be the customer service Rick. agent. And yourself. I will be the customer, the, the math customer. I will be. 
Fernando yeah. will be the delivery guy and Doris will be the supervisor. Okay, yes. we can try. The oh, teacher is not here, supposedly. Irene can help me and be uh, uh, customer uh, agent. Okay. Oh, okay. I can take an order and I really can solve the problem. Uh, okay. Okay, well, let's start. Three. <laughs> good morning. Tell me. Good oh, morning. Oh. This is... Good morning. My name is Rick. How can I help you? Hi, Rick. And I'm calling Flavor Donuts. Um, okay. Yes, uh, no. <laughs> you I am asking the... you, is I am calling the correct department? Ah, uh, yeah, you are. Uh, is what the name of the company? Donuts, crazy donuts. I don't remember. Crazy donuts, something like that. Yeah, it's crazy donuts. Okay. But you... Okay, guys. Mm -hmm. You ordered in is for chocolate donuts and then it's number string raspberry and i remember the others okay we can start again if you can share the conversation will be better because i didn't i didn't got it okay. and we can we can make correction is is needed camila te tomaste la leche was four chocolate donuts and two sugar donuts. And I remember that I mentioned 10, another 10 for. No, I just mentioned it only that. Okay, we can leave it as that. No, no, that. Another thing. Okay, we can start since the beginning. Yeah, good morning. My name is Rick. How can I help you? Hi, Rick. This is Ali. Uh, I want to place an order. I want some donuts for chocolate and two sugar donuts. Place. Place an order, yes. Wait. Silent. This is, uh, this is a role play, but if you need to use reported speech, this includes more than three or four person, people. Just, um, it's okay, do what you did before. Okay. As long as we have a conversation, we're okay. 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 So uh, we need to practice and we need to know who is going to be the, mm -hmm. the agent and who is going to be the customer. So I don't know, we, I was talking yesterday to, to, to Erwin. Customer or tech support? It, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It could a, be. He liked the, the, for to take a, a food, yeah? I remember. Yes, and, uh, do you remember? I, yes, I began with that. Uh, yeah. Okay, I, I, I can be. This one. Can let you... me see. Yes, let me see. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. okay. Did, you, did you remember that? Okay. And I explained that mm -hmm. the, this, this is a script. Yeah? Yes. A similar script, okay? 
when you have the company to deliver it full. Mm, but I, I... You can change, yeah, you can change. This is the idea. But we have to, to, to be... Uh, uh, <clears throat> I, I don't know if we, we, we continue with, with this or we have to talk about with Edwin said. Because, uh -huh. yeah, because we, in the, in the first, we, we was talking, we was talking with, uh, we were talking about this. Uh-huh. So but so this, we, this item, we already know that. Uh-huh. Yeah. So, I don't know. If someone wants to practice with me right now, actually, we can do the role play right now. I could be the agent and someone could be the customers, the customer and the they can, they can answer me, uh, they can question me, whatever they, what, what they need, right? Mm -hmm. What okay. do you need? Uh, who, wants, who wants to be the, uh, the customer? Man, this is the perfect scenario for my family. When we order pizza, you, the, um, the people taking the, the order, you know, the agent, Sometimes they hear they hear in the background, ask him for the rolls, ask him for the rolls, ask him to bring a soda, ask him to bring a soda. So a reported speech will be man. <laughs> there was this kid yelling out loud, you know, in the background, uh, telling the dad to ask for for pizza rolls and and, and to bring pizza to bring soda. You know, that's reported speech. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm just giving you an idea. Yeah, this is the idea. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Stop the chair. Mm. Uh -huh. I don't know. Go ahead. I can copy. I can copy this one. Okay. I can copy, uh -huh. and I can. Uh, I can. can we use the reporter speech. Yes. Can you see? Can you see in the chat? Yeah. Thanks. The go. Uh, few weeks in yeah, okay. plural. Mm -hmm. A few weeks okay. Mm -hmm. uh, we put on a specific um date or what? Yes, I think we can we can uh, put a a date. For example, uh, in January. Mm. January 2nd. I guess. Um, no. My God, I can't remember. Um, I bought it a few weeks ago. Someone true? help me, please. Uh, I don't know if you so. I remember it was on, in January 2nd. Yeah. Oh, January second. Okay. Now the agent. I, I get it on. Yeah. On yes. Yeah, it's on. Okay. Now the agent have to. To explain to the supervisor the situation with the client. Yeah. 
Give me a, mo a moment or one moment. A moment. No? Moment. Give me a moment. Give me a moment. Yeah. Oh, the a supervisor. Okay. The customer, the customer said, where is that? That, that she bought um, I don't know if this is the right. My watch. Who said that she bought? She bought this my watch. Uh, no, did you say for a smartwatch? Oh, I think we have to use a uh, past perfect in this case because the, yes. the client. Mm -hmm. The customer she, said that she bought. She had, she had bought, she had bought the smartwatch on January 2nd. Okay, now the supervisor can give some instructions to, to search the, the tracking number or now in the system. I don't know. Oh no, we can, we can. Remember, Blanca, that the, that the agent has to call the UPS delivery system. Yeah. Uh, maybe the supervisor can tell to the agent that, that we have to research, I think, or, or, or I don't know how to say, investigar. Research. Yeah, we have to research uh, what is the problem with the with the delivery business, and we have we are going to communicate with when we have the when when we have the answer. I think something like that. Delivery. I don't know. Okay, we have to pull up here to find what happened with the delivery. <sighs> okay, agent. I don't know if we if we tell the customer that we return the call or something like that. Yes, I think because uh, the agent needed uh, several minutes to to give the, to, to, to receive the information from mm -hmm. the UPS. Yes, maybe the agent need to tracking in the system, what happened with the shipment. Maybe the customer, the custom stop the shipment because they have some problems for maybe for a season. Oh, no. Um, just let me pass this to your. We had a chat in this group. I don't know, teacher. We we can share this on a chat. Yep. No. Oh, hi. Let me see. But. Uh, oh, it just was okay. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, well, I copy this. Okay. So, mm -hmm. I, I, I hear you guys. Okay, now I think the, the agent or I don't know if anyone else can 
type the, the role play on a word. Okay, Beach. I can do that. Let me copy the text you sent yep. and I will add the, the rest of the conversation. Okay. Okay, we have to go with yes, don't. Okay. What do you think if uh, now the agent calls to the UPS to, to ask about the, the order of the client? But first we have to tell the customer that we, we re oh, yes. that he returned the call. Okay. Mm -hmm. Go to UPS in order to research about the order. Yeah. Okay. We will return the call. Hold you back. Mm -hmm. Okay. As as soon as have as um, or you can use as soon as possible. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Now, uh, the supervisor now the made the call or, or the agent? No, the agent made the call to UPS. Okay. To, to see what happened. Or maybe it could be the, <laughs> the conversation. Yeah. Oh, you guys, because we use the reporter speech, but I don't know. Yes, I think we can. We can. I think that the, we have uh, to. We have to take the the information of the. I don't know. The order, the number order, the number. Or, yes, we didn't ask to the to the yeah to the <laughs> customer the reference. <laughs> Just only yes. with the number, number of the of, case, the number of the order we can track. search on the system. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. track on the system and see what is the tracking number for UPS. I think. Okay, let me add this. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay. Mm, no. When I haven't received it yet, you, you can text um, what's the order tracking or something like that. Mm -hmm. What's the number order? May you please? Uh... Oh, can you give me the tracking number? Please, uh, uh, um, uh, give a direct address and number of custom and uh, name of the customer. 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 Okay. Uh, thank you so much. Sorry. Thank, thank you so much for your help, Doris. Okay. Please the, the name and address. Yo creo que eso ahí lo dejamos en que se sí, se, se ajá. Ajá, se, que usted va a resolver usted in that you going to resolve that that situation and I'm going to say thank you for, thank you for your help. Okay. Yes. Yes, okay. Okay. We're going to practice again. 
Ok. Mm, ok. Ring. Oh. Ring. Back to back está. Oh, good morning. You are calling to Crazy Donut. I'm, my name is Rick. How can I help you? Hi, Rick. This is Sally. I want to place an order. I want some donuts, please. For chocolate donuts for, and two sugar donuts, please. Okay, your order is placed ready. Could you provide your name, address, and uh, your phone address, your name, please? Okay, uh, my name is Sally uh, Rivas, and my phone number is 7725311. My mailing address is uh, Merliot, Pasaje 25, Código Postal 113, <laughs> Cisco 11321. Uh, okay. May I request, uh, is, could, you be, could you be so kind to place my order to be on time because I want the donuts for my date? Okay, your order uh, is placed in, in 30 minutes. It's okay for you? Oh, perfect. Will be perfect. Okay. Thank you. Have a wonderful day. Uh, you're welcome. You're welcome. Hello, Fernando. Hello. Can you turn an order to Merliot in 30 minutes? 30 minutes? What the customer said? Uh, the client asked if you can be on time. That's it. Uh, but uh, at this time in the city, the traffic is horrible, but I will try. I will try to do my best. Okay. Thanks for, for your efforts. We again. Yes. Ring. Oh, okay. Answer. Hello. You're calling to Crazy Donuts. How can I help you? Hello, this is Sally. I place an order and suppose it will be here in 30 minutes, but it's already uh, an hour and the guy is not coming up. I have not received any call I see notification yet. I guess I talked to you before. Thanks. Oh, really? I'm so sorry for to hear that. I'm going to call the delivery guy and I'll call you back in a few minutes. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. <laughs> Go well, ahead. Thanks anyway. <laughs> okay. Hello, Fernando. Oh, hello, man. Oh, the clients ask what's going on with her order. Sorry for uh, for that for dear. I, I couldn't advise you about. I had an accident, so I had I am in the hospital right now, and the, the paramedic said. Uh, if I I drank before leaving the the store, but I I don't like alcohol or something like that. But they they asked me for for my time, and I have to to be in the hospital. Maybe uh, they have to check my all my my injuries, and I don't know how how much time that could could take. I'm really so sorry to hear that, but uh, don't worry about it. Irene, I have a situation with a delivery guy. Uh, he has an accident. Come on. Man, that was fast. You you came really fast. <laughs> okay. You are um, to us. Really? No. Yeah. <laughs> it was almost half an hour. Come on, guys. We have to cover today's topic as well. But before moving on, we have to do the attendance really quick, okay? So say press and turn on your cameras, please. Put your name. Show your face. InsaForb likes to audit this portion of the video. So let's go. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Present. 
Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Let me do something really quick. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Erika Beatriz López Morales. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Francisco Madeo Villacorta Chávez. Present. Freddy Vladimir Cortés López. I'm here, teacher. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos. Amos Alfredo García Granadino. Present teacher. Amos, we're staying 10 minutes after the class, okay? Nos quedamos 10 minutos después de la clase. Good? Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Jose Alberto Salas Benitez. Present teacher. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present teacher. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Thought I saw Luis around. Is Luis here? Can you hear me? Present. Yeah. Yeah, I can hear you now. Thank you. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Okay. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Jessica Yanari Cortez Díaz. I'm here. Okay. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Suleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Guys, Present. just taking one minute of your time. Don't forget to complete the platform. Move on as much as you can. Tonight, I'm reviewing your progress on the platform and uploading your grades. So let's i'll stay on doing that and reviewing the platform so let's go with group number one doris fernando irene josue and jocelyn okay okay go ahead Josue. Okay, okay, go ahead. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Hello. Uh, thank you for calling Crazy Donuts. My name is Rick. How can I help you? Hello, this Rick. This is Sally. Uh, I want to place an order, please. Would you help me? Sure. Uh, okay. Could you? Perfect. I want. Sorry, continue. Sorry. Okay, uh, your order is for uh, chocolate donuts and two sugar donuts. Ah, yes, it is. I, I, uh, could you do me so kind to be a fa uh, Could you do me a favor? Uh, sure. Could you be so kind to pro to tell to the delivery the guy to be on time because I request and uh, the donuts as soon as possible, maybe in thirty minutes. As uh, sure. As, yes, as soon as possible because it's for yeah. my date. Okay, don't worry. Uh, could you provide your phone address and name, please? Okay, my name is Sally Rivas. My phone is 7213-1920. And my mailing address is uh, 119 Merleau City, uh, Block 3, Cisco 1132. Okay, your order is placed uh, in 30 minutes. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for hearing me. Bye. Bye. Oh, hello, Fernando. Hello. Can you take an order to Merliot in 30 minutes? 30 minutes? What the customer said? Well, the customer asked if you can be on time. Man, but in this city at this time, traffic is horrible, but I will try to do that. I will do my best. Okay. Okay, and I'm calling in. Oh, <laughs> hello. Thank you for calling Crazy Donuts. I can help you. Hello, this is Sally. I placed an order 
and I guess I talk to you. Are you Rick? Yeah, yeah, I'm Rick. As an apologize, uh, Sally. What what happened with your order? The delivery guy is not coming. I have not received any call, any notification. I don't know what happened. You mentioned that will you will you will do your best for the order to be on time in 30 minutes. But it's not coming yet and already past an hour. Ah, okay. Let me call uh, the delivery guy and I call you back in a few minutes. Oh, come on. Mm, anyway. <laughs> also, Bye. sorry, Sally. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, hello, Fernando. Oh, hello, man. Oh, the, the customer asked what's going on with her order. Oh, man, sorry for not letting you know earlier, but I had an accident with a car. But I am fine, but I am in the hospital. Uh, man, was was a crazy, crazy. I am, I am fine, but that was a miracle because the 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 car was a a sound speed that I I didn't see when he crashed me. But the police the police said uh, if I I saw something, but I couldn't I couldn't saw see anything but uh, I I have to to be in the hospital because they they want to to ensure that I am fine I uh, sorry I I I won't I won't deliver I won't I, I won't complete it to deliver oh don't worry about it and I'm so sorry to hear that I hope to be very soon thank you bye man bye Oh, hi, 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 good morning. I, I have a, a situation. You can you help me with uh, Sally's uh, order uh, that the delivery guy has an accident and will not able to take an order. Please call in to Sally and and explain the situation please because I, I have another order. Yes, I can, don't worry. Okay, thank you. When Jocelyn. Hi, my name is Alina Jocelyn. Who are you? <laughs> Hi, good morning. Nice to hear you, Jocelyn. My name is Irene Cuellar and I'm calling to apologize from Crazy Donuts because our delivery guys had a terrible accident and in this moment he is at the hospital. Uh, but uh, we're going to solve this problem and uh, in 20 minutes we're going to deliver your order and, and we'll be free for you. Ah, okay. And I offer an apology, guys, uh, uh, for this inconvenience. I'm so sorry to hear that the delivery guy got an accident. I'm sorry, and I hope that he will be okay. Uh, suppose your Rick will call me back. You call me. Well, anyway, back. I noticed what happened, and I'm really sorry. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much. Have a nice okay. day. Bye. Queen Doris, hello. Hello, Irene. What Hi, happened? Doris. Uh, we have a problem with uh, order and we need to your help, please. And uh, we need to deliver our order in 20 minutes. Please, you can help me. Okay, let me see. Okay. Uh, uh, the other branch office is a uh, uh, has a has a delivery guys uh, is free. Thank you, thank you so much. Please. Irene. Hi. Hi. Okay. Uh, the in the other branch office. Send me a uh, uh, other delivery guys. It's uh, no problem with uh, your customer. Uh, 
customer. Thank you so much for your help, your Doris. See you. Have a nice day. Bye. That's all. Okay, and you can see um, I'm just typing uh, the any area of improvement on the chat. Uh, as, as soon as you say something wrong, I'm just typing it regarding reported speech. So go taking notes. Um, most part of the errors are on reported speech, which is the main topic we're seeing. The customer asked me if you could be on time. The customer asked what was going on with her order. Some pronunciation like so, not so. You do that a lot. The delivery. Not the delivery, the delivery. The delivery guy said he had an accident. You could have used, that's an observation. You could have used uh, reported speech there. I hope he's fine. I hope he gets better ways of saying. And by the way, I love this customer's reaction. I would have said something like, oh my God, he had an accident. Okay. Free done it. <laughs> Okay, could you help me, please? Um, hmm, please, could you help? Okay, uh, could you help me, please? That's the right way. The other branch office told me, the other branch, yeah, the other branch told me, just the other branch. Okay, say to me, uh, told me, told me. Okay, good job, I guys. My customer. <laughs> I you play my customer teacher. I know, but you play good a good role as as customer. Actually, angry customer. Okay, group number two: Alexander, Andres, Fredis, Yuri, Sandra, and Suleima. It's not needed for everybody to speak, you know. But this this was a a great example. Applause, please. An applause. Come on. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, let's group with group number two. Teacher, can I share my screen? Totally, all yours. Okay. 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 Um, okay. I'm, I'm, gonna be, uh, I'm gonna be the, the agent, right? Okay. Okay. Okay, good evening. Thank you for calling Crossic Burgers. What would you like to order? I would like to order a hamburger. Okay, what kind of hamburger would you like to? I would like to order a grilled chicken burger. Excellent. Do you want to all the vegetable? Yes, please. Excellent. Do you want to drink? What do you want to drink? Uh, diet Coke. Perfect. Coke small, medium, or large? Uh, medium. Excellent. Now, let me repeat your order. <clears throat> A real chicken burger with all vegetables and medium soda. That's your order, right? Yes. Okay. Your order is in process and the liver will be in 30 minutes. Okay. Excellent. Is there something else that I can help you with? No, just that. Okay. okay. It was my pleasure. Thank you for calling. Have a nice day. Okay. After that, uh, the time is over and the customer didn't get the order. And Stage he called, two. He called <laughs> Where's my order? <laughs> <laughs> I've been waiting for more than one hour. I am really starving. I really apologize for the inconvenience. Let me check what happened with your order. I'm going to get my best in order to solve the problem as soon as possible. May I have your order number, please? Yes, the order number is the 5743. Okay, Mr. Smith, could you confirm your Address, please. My address is 74 Main Street, New York, zip code 
8-7-7-4-4. Thank you. I verify your information. Your order has another address. So your order was delivered to an another address. The supervisor wants to be the supervisor. Me. Okay. okay. Uh, who called you? Okay. Okay. <clears throat> A customer who placed an order more than an hour ago. What did he tell you? The customer asked me how long he will wait for this order, his order. What was the problem? The system didn't allow me input the order in the right address. Call the customer and tell him his order is going to be free. Okay. That's uh, excellent. Okay. Okay. Oh, what is... Okay. Thank you. Thank you for following me, Mr. Smith. Mr. Smith, are you there? Yes, here I am. Excellent. Um, I was talking with my supervisor in order to solve your, your issue. And my supervisor told me that we are going to send your order for free. Okay, thank you. Okay, I are you really agree with that? Uh, do you agree? Do you agree with that? Yeah, it's okay, no problem. Okay. Okay. Thank you for <laughs> that's for enough. <laughs> okay, your order is going to be free. Hmm. It's going to be free. Your order is going to be free. It's not for free. It's going to be for free. Mm. Your order is going to be free of charge. Your order is going to be on the house. Okay. Otherwise, good. Thank you for holding me. Mm. Mm -hmm. Thank you for holding me. It's like that meme, you know. Agarrame, agarrame. <laughs> right. Same thing, holding me. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hmm. Edwin. Irwin, Jarvin, Thelma, William, and Jessica. All yours. Hi guys. Um, teacher, we can do we can do uh, hi guys, how are you? We can listen to you. Yeah, we can hear you. We can hear you. The one, you two, three, action. And yes, you can share if you want the screen. We can uh, share this one. Just one moment. But it is so easy because uh, in the in the in the one speech in the company, you have you have the information when one customer called you, okay? And you identify the number that deal and you can now how is uh, called you in the when, when the company have the software in the call center yes teacher it's okay irwin is not the page um okay don't worry all i need is a conversation yeah okay. go ahead this one so easy Okay, hi, thanks for calling to Happy Pizza in the name of the company. I speak with the Lopez family because the customer now, the company now who is calling. What do Mr. Carlos want tonight? The customer now who is calling because the number is in the, in the, in the now now with the company. We invite you to special promotion, five pass for, the, for one. What tap do you want? With mulcher, ham, extra cheese, pimple, apple, or pickles. Okay, we will send it always to his house, to your house, sorry, to your house. Yeah, only that is yeah. 
Okay. Nobody was interacting with you or? Okay. Since really, since really teacher, we didn't, we didn't agree with this sentence. Okay. Since really, yeah. Try to agree when you're working in groups. That's very important. And just create a conversation as simple. Okay, okay, don't worry. Let's go with group number four, Blanca, Erika, Francisco, Amos, Luis, Roberto, and Stefania. Oh my God, this was a big group. All yours. Teacher, I'm gonna share the, I'm gonna share the screen. Okay, and in this conversation, uh, Luis, I don't know if Luis is, is with us today. I, I, I be, I'll be, the Luis. You will be, okay, yeah. okay. 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 Hello, thank you for calling iShop. How can I help you today? Hello, I would like to know when I will receive my smartwatch. I will be happy to help you. Let me see what the status is in the system and why you haven't received it yet. May you please give me the tracking number? Yes, my tracking number is JAN022022. Okay, just give me one moment and I'll get back to you. What is happening with the customer? What is the problem? The customer asked when she will receive the smartwatch. Did you ask the customer when did she buy the smartwatch? Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Um, I, I lost. Oh, okay. Thank you for your wait. I need to know when did you place your order? I bought it a few weeks ago. I remember it was on January 2nd. Okay. Thank you. Let me check. Give me a moment, please. Uh, the customer said that she had bought the smartwatch on January 2nd. Okay, we must call uh, UPS to find what happened with the delivery. Okay. Um, thank you for your waiting. I need to call to UPS to research about your order. We will call you back as soon as possible. Okay, I I'll be waiting. Um, the UPS agent, <laughs> Francisco. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Hello, thank you for calling to UPS business. How can you help you? Help, help you? Sorry. Hi, I need to track one order. Our customer reported that she had placed her order on January 2nd. The tracking number is JAN022022. Okay, let me let me check. Oh, sorry. Let me verify the information. Okay. Hello. I'm glad to. I'm I'm just calling the customer again. <laughs> Black <Blanco>, pickup. <laughs> okay. Hello. I'm glad Hello. to. Let, hello. <laughs> 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 Sorry, teacher. <laughs> we didn't finish the conversation. But <laughs> that's that's <day. laughs> Okay, keep it up. Keep it up. Um, hello. I'm 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 talking to Blanca. Yeah, Blanca Navarro. Hello. Yeah. I'm glad to let you know that your product is now in custom house, so you will receive it in the next days. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you for your time. Bye. Okay, uh, verify. Let me verify. Let me check. Let me double check. Let me find out. Let me verify. Verify. Uh, this is a common error we can make. Um, treat, and this is uh, very American, actually. You know, they tend to say a positive sentence with the intonation of a question. Okay, you got it? or do you got it? 
well, got it. See, it's, ah, that's normal. Am I talking to? Now, and this is an exception. You must say it this way. Am I talking to Blanca? Is this Blanca? Okay, or simply some people just go like, oh, Blanca Ramirez? Yeah, okay. You got it. And ta 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 ta. That's it. Okay, that's it. You see? Simple. It's just narrating what happened, right? That's reported speech. So whenever you find yourself in this situation, uh, this is something that you should practice very often, you know. <laughs> Actually, uh, you know who uses reported speech all the time? Nowadays, teenagers. Teenagers. Okay. Want to wanna try? Um, Stefania. You're my be you're my BFF. Why me? Yeah. Okay. Okay, and Erica, you're my BFF too. Okay, turn on your microphones. Okay. You know, guys, I saw I saw uh, Francisca last night. I didn't know what name to use. Oh my god, I saw Francisca last night, my ex girlfriend. All you have to say is really no oh my way. God, no way. <laughs> yeah, she's gorgeous. She's beautiful now. Wow. Um, I don't know what to do. I, I don't want to be, you know, bad with my girlfriend now. You know how Rosa Rosa treats me very well, but Francisca is, oh my God. <laughs> what do you think? It took me. He took her out of me. What? <laughs> what? When, when, when you say that uh, someone else it, uh, take away from uh, uh, your ex, I think. Uh, I think that she you stay can away. say uh, he took me. He took her. Oh, she took she took my breath away. Take my no, breath away. no. But when you say that someone else is it's with your ex-girlfriend or something like that, you can say that he took her away or something like that. Oh, he took her away he from me. Away. He took her away from me. Uh, ah, yeah. No, but there's no yeah. way. There's no third party here. Here, she's single, guys. She's single. So, wow. I, yeah, I saw oh her at the gosh. cafe. I saw her at the cafe and she told me that she had missed me. I don't know what to do. And you miss her too? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Remember, all you have to say is, really? Really? Yeah, okay. No way. Oh my God. No way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, but this, no you way. know, teenagers have this, this common American teenagers. Uh, oh, and then we, I saw her, right? And, and she was like, she was like, um, let's have something for dinner. And I was like, no. And she was like, uh, let's hang out together. And I was like, oh, man, Rosa is going to kill me. But she gave me her number. And, and I was like, afraid of, have you heard that on teenagers? They go like, and then she said like, and then she was like, <laughs> <laughs> they're <Yeah>. narrating. <laughs> but they're using narrative. So don't do that try to use reported speech okay practice that part and that's a clear example a gossip okay, okay. thank you girls <laughs> okay no. let's let's move i want to share something with you before we go to the next activity um pay attention please this is what you should do when we do a video dynamic like the one we're going to carry on right now please pay attention to your screen do you see the YouTube screen? Mimits. No. Okay. Just look at the screen. This is a previous class, okay? But I want to show you, some of you may not know, that on your YouTube, you have this option, subtitles, okay? Closed captions, CC. Okay, so you can click on it and have the, the closed caption turned on. Okay? You turn on... It will be auto-generated, and you can see the closed caption. Teacher, but sometimes the videos are too fast, are going too fast. 
Okay, then you can go here to configuration. Then you go to speed, okay? Playback speed, and you can reduce the speed. Don't do it too much because it's gonna be weird. It's gonna sound really weird. So do 0.75, for example. Resolve the problem. Natter, Natter policy. Oh, I'm sorry, I jumped one. Sure, deal, okay. deal with and so on. So I'm just explaining you because you need to have the subtitle, the, the closed caption on and reduce the, the speed if you want to go check in any new vocabulary. The, the following activity, it's two videos about today's topic, which is identity, identity, identity theft, identity theft, identity theft. Difficult. Yeah, someone said teacher. On the video. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> okay, good. So let's get together. I'll send you right now the links for the two videos. What is identity theft? It's very short. They're very short, actually. You should have no problem watching these videos. There goes the first one. What do I need from you? Pay attention, get new vocabulary out of it, and then discuss with your classmates. I'll make you some questions tomorrow about these two videos, but please have a discussion with your classmates and I'll make I'll ask for your opinion when we come back, okay? Randomly, the ones that haven't talked. Let's go. Don't share, don't share the screen. What is identity theft? Identity theft affects millions of people each year around the world. Crafty fraud.
Did you finish? I finished already. What did you say, friends? I finished already. Oh, okay. Which video did you watch first? Uh, uh, Identity Yeah. Okay. Okay, I, I heard in this video uh, something I never have listened before that when you receive a call and they are asking for sensitive information, you have to go to the website and verify the number. So you can avoid uh, a fraud. Uh, 
Another important thing is that when you sell an item that, you, that you're not using anymore or you throw in away an item, you have to erase all the data that you have on the item. Yes. What else? Did you finish? I almost finished. Okay, we're going, we going to talk about the first video that okay. the identity theft. You see, for example, that occurred, for example, in the last, uh, in the, with a Chivo, Chivo wallet, identity theft, identity death was something that occurred there and for example if you go to the twitter you are going to find many people over there trying to confuse the people a uh, present uh, show that they are support she will support 
And when you go to the link, you are going to receive a form that get all information from your cell phone and they get all many, many, many information that uh, is necessary to unlock your account. It's something that the video speak. For example, when you are going to go, when you go out to a website, you need to write it because if you just click a link that you receive from email or something like that, uh, sometimes the hackers be, uh, hide some characters from that message and you think that you are on the correct website, but that isn't true. They change a little bit the text and that message and you don't see it. That's why many people lost a lot of money. Um, other other practice is a good practice is uh, uh, don't use uh, many places and uh, your credit card, many websites, your credit card, for example. Maybe that is the reason why the PayPal is 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 good option because you don't you don't use your credit card in many websites. Just you use your user um, PayPal and when you are going to use, uh, you are going to pay something, just you, ref, you, ref, you use your user on PayPal and the website doesn't know what is you. Actually, I have, a, I have that kind of alert in my email and for that reason. Mm -hmm. um, because I I I I I don't know what is I I'm sorry I'm just distrust I think is distrust and all kind of trans transaction. Transaction. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I prefer uh, SMS because it's uh, faster than email. Some, sometimes you don't check your email, but if you receive a text, <laughs> uh, it's faster, I think. Uh, email too. Email too. Well, well uh, I see all, uh, all emails. Uh, WhatsApp or other other kinds of message. Uh, I I I be alert with that. And well, Luis, what do you think? In the the best ways. Um, use credit card and pay a secure insurance sorry for the your your credit card because uh, if you reported a transaction that you never do you can ask for a, a insurance service and they uh, return to you to the money that was uh, charged in your um, count uh, activate um, a text message for example I do for my credit card in, for the the credit card that my wife use I receive a, a, a message for every transaction that she make or me with my credit card <laughs> and that's um, that is another way to control your 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 uh, how do you are spending your money? Finances. Yes, yeah. and, uh, I like to to check my e-bank too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You have better. Yes, you can check in with your with the apps. Uh, yeah. Of the banks, you can the check e every every time. Mm -hmm. 
Yes. And I trust I try not using uh, the the numbers of the the credit card with the the number um, I don't know how to say the in the back, back uh, side of the credit card you, you have a an, an, a specific number. Username. The three, three, uh -huh. No, the three digits. Mm. That is the approved the, the purchase. Mm. I try to not use that uh, only uh, paying physical and just that I think. Do you know what? Uh, mm -hmm. You don't have to use, uh, for example, your debit card or your credit card to purchase in the store. Bravo, bravissimo. That's the way you have to work in groups. I saw many of you having a great conversation. It was an interesting topic, right? Okay, really quick. Give me one word that you learned on this video. Just a word or a phrase. A security of the face website. Uh, I'm sorry. Security depth. Security theft. Okay. Hmm. With the theft. Uh, you mean the the last the S? System. The last S on HTTPS means security or secure. Yes, and oh. the information is encrypted. Is encrypted. Mm -hmm. mm. I never understood what is encrypted, but anyways. <laughs> it's encrypted. Nobody can see the bridges to avoid data bridges. Okay. Data bridges. Data bridges. Okay. What else? What else? Uh, wipe data. Really? You learned the term? Nah. <laughs> no, but that is you... interesting. <laughs> wipe data. Or yes. white. No, wipe. W I P. Wipe. Yes. Like wipe data okay what else what else uh you have to put the your credit card information uh on a limit number of websites to be more secure for you on a limited a limited number of websites okay that's lurking what is lurking Luis, on your own words This um, is for like safe. I'm sorry, go ahead. It's for safe the website online. Mm. Frosters are always lurking. Frosters are always lurking. A froster can be lurking, could be lurking. Okay. I'm always lurking my ex girlfriend. No, 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 I'm just saying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, silly. Hey. <laughs> your wife, your wife. Come on. What? Hey, what? What? Okay. Uh huh. Next. Next. Did you ever heard about identity theft before this class? Yeah. Okay, have you ever heard of anybody that you know who had been a victim of identity theft in El Salvador? Yes. Yes. Yeah, yeah. A yes. month ago, Banco Agricola has a big yeah. problem. Had, had, had a big problem. Had you a big you know, problem. I don't believe that. I don't know why, but I, I, that wasn't social media. That wasn't social media. But come on, guys, it's just. I work at a bank. It was true. It was true? Yeah. Oh, okay. I believe you. Yeah, I saw that on Twitter and I was like, nah, because I work at a bank too. And I'm like, mm, I don't know, it's too difficult. I mean, and the, the thing is that 
people is so naive in this country. You know what is naive, right? I'm not saying naive, but I'm saying naive. Okay. Mm. So so innocent, you know, that you easily fall in their game. If you watch the video carefully, one of the easiest ways of somebody getting your data is calling you. Just calling you, you know, hey, congratulations, you won a million dollars. Okay, <laughs> elderly. In the United States, this is very common because there's a lot of elderly people alone at home, home alone. And this mm, bastards, I'm sorry if I use that word, but these people without a mother, they call these people, you know, elderly, and they go like, hey, congratulations, you won a prize. I just need you to transfer me the picture of three gift cards with $300 on each one, you know, for the fees that we charge is $900. Okay. That's crazy. Go to Google. I mean, go to YouTube and watch videos of identity theft. There's a guy actually catching there's a techie guy on YouTube. I'll share a video with you later about a guy who is very techie and he introduces a virus into the computers of the frosters there in India. And he turns on the webcam on their computer. And he goes like, I got you. Man, it's crazy. Okay. And it's very nice to, to watch. Okay. Uh, we got to go. I'm staying with Amos tonight for 10 minutes. It was nice class. Nice class. Alexander de Jesus Sanchez Soto. Okay. Andres Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Christian, good night. Good night. Blanca Stephanie Navarro Flores. Present, good night. Good night. Dora Elizabeth Flores Mendez. Present, good night. Good night, Edwin Alexander Ayala Eraso. Present, good night. Good night, Erika Beatriz Lopez Morales. Present, good night. Good night, Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present, teacher, good night. Good night, Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present, good night. Good night, Francisco Amadeo Villacorta Chavez. Present, good night, teacher. Good night, Fredis Vladimir Cortez Lopez. Good night, guys. Good night, teacher. Glenda Laura Celada Renderos, Eimos Alfredo García Granadino. Present. José Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Present. Good night, teacher. Good night. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. And good night, everybody. Good night. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Estefanía Carolina Reyes Sánchez. Present. Good night. Good night. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Okay, Jessica Yanari Cortez Diaz. I'm here. Good night. Good night. Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Good night. Good night. Roberto Luis Omaño Orellana. Suleima Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Good night. Good night. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present. Good night. Jarvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. Present. Good night. Good night. And Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez. Good night. The, the Perry. Thelma Clotilde Peña Martinez, the Perry. <gasps> oh my God. Oh <laughs> you dream, yeah, you yeah. dream. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're journey. Yeah. Of course. Good night, honey. Okay. Bye bye. Okay. Amos. Bueno, esta es nuestra primera sesión, es primera vez que estamos en un one-on-one, -on -one, una sesión de 10 minutos. Yo siempre que tengo una sesión por primera vez con alguien, siempre suelo um, abrir um, este espacio con dos preguntas. La primera, um, ¿cuál ha sido su experiencia con el inglés? ¿Dónde lo ha aprendido? ¿Por qué le llamó la atención? O sea, hábleme de, de su historia con el inglés. Y pues ahora, ¿cuál es el propósito, no? Y... Lo segundo que estoy haciendo, yo Amos, aparte de las dos horas que tengo de clase, para mejorar mi inglés. O sea, fuera de inglés corporativo, ¿qué más hago para practicarlo? Bueno, este, inicialmente inicié en la pandemia, en el 2020. 
eh, justamente cuando nos quedamos todos en casa eh, para aprovechar un poco más el tiempo eh, y aprender, ¿verdad? porque la verdad que sí tenía, bueno, eh, en el tiempo que yo estudié, pues no, el inglés no era muy, muy importante todavía en las universidades. Eso fue ese, ese tiempecito. Sin embargo, este, comencé en la Academia Europea, eh, le di una promoción y comencé y, y bueno, eh, seguí hasta, realmente seguí hasta diciembre del año pasado, ¿verdad? Eh, ya después de la pandemia, pues obviamente comencé a trabajar y la cosa se puso más complicada porque ya no estaba pues en casa, ya no estaba en el 100%, eh, pues soy un hombre pues que se le trabaja todos los días como cualquiera y el detalle es que viajo todos los días de, de Santa Ana, San Salvador todos los días eh, yo trabajo en San Salvador ingeniero civil. siempre he vivido en Santa Ana yo siempre he vivido en Santa Ana nunca, nunca me he movido de, de aquí por mm. temas digamos de nostalgia familiar <ríe> acá tengo a mi hija mi hija pues no, tengo a mi esposa me acabo de casar yo por rato me eh, quiero regresar para allá. Ah, no, hombre, qué bueno. Sí, eh, sí no, la verdad que empecé, pero obviamente pues eh, no he estado, eh, he estado pues avanzando poco a poco. La verdad no ha sido eh, una cosa constante. Han habido pausas, luego volver a intentarlo. Y así he estado hasta uh -huh. que vi la promoción. Bueno, de hecho, vi la promoción y... y eh, de poderme ingresar, pero también me estoy enfrentando nuevamente a, a que, que tenía pues, días de no estar practicando y, y al mismo tiempo, pues, el, 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 yo siento que acá el, eh, digamos, la, la logística es bastante como agresiva, ¿no? Entonces, eh, sí, me, me ha costado un poco adaptarme por el tema de mi tiempo, que mm. tengo, pues... O sea, yo ¿La logística, que... Juan, en qué? ¿En lo administrativo o la clase en sí? No, la clase es agresiva, o sea, es muy participativa, eh, porque a pesar de que hay muchos estudiantes, porque en, la, en, la otra, en otro lugar pues habían cuatro, tres, que cinco, entonces uh -huh. obviamente pues estábamos pagando, eh, sin embargo, eh, aquí es más participativo, ¿verdad? hay más homework, hay más todo eso, entonces eh, yo había estado como muy pausado, yo sentía que sinceramente no estaba aprendiendo lo que estaba pagando. Entonces, eh, eh, pausé en diciembre por esa uh -huh. razón, porque yo me sentía estancado. Obviamente, eh, mi tiempo también me, me dificulta. Y, y bueno, yo estoy aquí con la intención de aprender, ¿verdad? Eh, si me preguntara uh -huh. qué estoy haciendo más allá de momento, uh -huh. lo único que he hecho es estudiar, digamos, los, los videos eh, de, las, de YouTube de las clases, he estado, pues voy en el carro y lo voy escuchando, pero yo sé que no debería ser así o sea, eh, por mi ¿Cómo, tiempo ¿Cómo debería de ser entonces? No, ajá, debería de ser, yo tuviera apartar digamos un par de horas diario y poderlo hacer uh -huh. eso es lo que yo pienso es lo Ah, que, mire es lo que a mí me, me ¿Cuál, es horario, ¿Cuál es su horario de trabajo, Emos? Mi horario de trabajo es de 8 de 8 en adelante hasta Obviamente yo salgo a las 6 de allá de Santa Tecla, por si le algo, ahí bajo los chorros, bueno, ya sabe el trafiquito de ahí. Eso es a diario. Y luego sí. vengo acá este, ya a recibir la clase medio, medio pues seno. Eh, uh -huh. Y la verdad sí me está costando un poco adaptarme con el tema tiempo, pero uh -huh. a pesar de que ya es a las 8, pero no, es una buena hora, pero igual uh -huh. pues este... Eh, más que todo, el problema es la, el, el practicar ya en las horas de, de libre. ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, yo solo tengo eh, prácticamente de las dos y media a las dos, a la hora de almuerzo. Ah, no, hombre, tiene, tiene <ríe> dos horas, tiene diarias libres. Libres y galán. Viene manejando, ¿verdad? Sí, sí. Ah, pues. ¿Y, la, ¿Y maneja su carro o de la empresa? No, es mi, es mi carro. Va. Ah, pues si ¿sí tiene Bluetooth. Tengo Bluetooth y, y, y tengo seguro también contra, contra cualquier accidente. <risa> Me llega, va. Entonces, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Ajá. A ver, ahí en el chat de WhatsApp lo voy a enviar otra vez. Ok. 
esta página eh, involucra muchas cosas. Eh, lo que les he enviado es un índice, un índice uh -huh. de, de audios. Ahí usted, bueno, hoy le han agregado un montón de publicidad a esta página, pero igual. Ahí está en colores, amarillo, azul, rosado, rojo. Y ahí va bajando, uh -huh. está en letras romanas. Entonces, indiscriminadamente, o sea, por eso, usted puede empezar en orden si quiere. School Life, bye. Tenemos School Life. School cerramos. Life. Ajá. Okay. Y de ahí le va a dar otro subíndice con 22 audios. ¿Qué son uh -huh. estos audios? Uh -huh. Estos audios, se abre cualquiera, va, se va a dar cuenta que está el, um, el script, el texto, ¿sí? Y arribita está el audio. Exactamente lo que dice. ¿Qué puedo hacer ah, con okay, esto? Okay, ¿Qué okay, puedo hacer okay. con esto? Fíjese que antes daban la opción de, de descargar el audio. Lástima que ya no. Pero bueno, usted con el teléfono, ingénieselas ahí, grábelo uh -huh. con el teléfono. ¿verdad? Y lo que está escrito, cuando uh -huh. no, no venga manejando, <ríe> lo puede ir... Yeah. Leyendo ahora, mi, la mejor manera de hacer esto hemos, es, es reescribir lo que está ahí o imprimirlo dejando el espacio de por medio. Uh -huh. y ahorita le explico por qué. So, día uno, con lo que he escrito en mi cuaderno y el audio que tengo en el teléfono, me pongo los audífonos yo solito, en paz, le voy a dedicar a esto media hora todos los días, tranquilo, en mi casa, antes de salir o cuando regreso, después de la clase. Sacrificios quiere la vida porque esto me va a triplicar Así el es. salario. ¿Sí o no? uh -huh. Entonces, media hora, tranquilo, los primeros dos, tres días, y siento que me cuesta. Ok, dos días. Eh, con la boca cerrada, solo estoy escuchando el audio y leyendo lo que dice. Uh -huh. Ok, ese es el primer día. Eh, el primer y segundo día. Luego de esto, que ya mi cerebro entendió que hay una manera diferente de leer las letras, eso es lo que estoy haciendo, porque el mayor problema que tengo ahorita, como adulto especialmente, uh -huh. es que mi cerebro quiere leer a la fuerza, o sea, inconscientemente, mi cerebro es tan inteligente, inconscientemente está luchando por leer las letras como las ha aprendido hasta ahora, después de 40, 30 años, no sé, ¿sí me explico? Uh -huh. Sí. Entonces, yo tengo que matar eso de primero, primero tengo que matar eso y enseñarle que no, güey, se dice de esta manera, hay otra manera de hacerlo, entonces solo lo voy a hacer leyendo nada más leyendo okay. y escuchando, metiéndole el audio ahí tienen que escuchar este ok uh -huh. Entonces, hey, you're in my English class después de dos días voy a repetir tranquilo, hey, pongo pausa you're in my English class no dijo you are, hey, you're in my English class uh -huh. trato de darle entonación y ahí voy ¿qué puedo hacer en el carro? esa parte, desde ahí puedo empezar en el carro uh -huh. Pum, pum, okay. pum, pum. Mire, después de cinco días de estar con esto, va a llegar un punto en el que ahora ya no voy a escuchar el audio, ahora voy a agarrar el teléfono, lo voy a ocupar para algo inteligente. Agarro la lectura, agarro el teléfono y me grabo, leyendo lo que ahí dice, entonando igual. ¿Cómo logro entonar igualito en la escritura? Ah, pues, ¿se acuerda lo que les dije? De ponerle la, una la, señal ahí. Una señal de, el de elevación de... de... De, Ajá. De, ¿Dónde sí. voy a elevar la voz cabal? ¿Dónde está el estrés de la sílaba? Vaya, y la última, o sea, el último recurso que voy a ocupar es reescribir debajo de cada línea cómo yo entiendo que se lee la cosa, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Si dice hey, solo para que me entienda, si dice hey, voy a poner hey, mm, yeah, usando yeah. mis letras, pero eso yeah, a yeah. mí no me gusta eso, pero es el último uh -huh. recurso, si de plano alguna palabra yo no le entiendo cómo se lee, cómo se dice, pues la reescribo debajo de ella. Ok. ¿Cómo se escucha realmente en español? Sí, correcto. Sí. Correcto. Uh, Ahora, ¿cuál es la última meta que yo tengo con esto? Bueno, ya leí. Ahora voy a leer igual como dice. Entonces, no me quedo solo grabando, ¿no? Le voy a dar play a los dos, a los dos audios. Le voy a prestar el teléfono a mi hija, a mi esposa. Préstame el teléfono, va. Te voy a mandar un audio. Pum, los dos. Hey, no me salió bien esa palabra. Porque la mejor manera de corregirse a uno mismo es escuchándose. Uh -huh. ¿Sí? Eso es un ejercicio excelente. No me cree. No empiece con esto. Empiece mañana que vaya para el trabajo. Ya relajado uh -huh. y empiece a pensar en algo. Haga de caso que usted está dando una conferencia. ¿Eh? Va uh -huh. manejando en español. 
y haga de caso que va a una conferencia, va poniendo el, atención al tráfico, vea, y va hablando de lo que usted quiera. ¿Ok? En español. Okay. Luego intente hacerlo en inglés. ¿Qué va a notar? Pero escúchese, ¿eh? ese es el punto, escucharse. Ajá. Y decir, Escuchame. uy, dije, y en español va a decir, dije, dije, híjole, no sé. <risa> dije las la una. Entonces se me sí. empezará a corregir uno solo, porque hay que corregirse desde el español. Claro, claro. ¿Ok? Gracias. Sí. Ánimo, ánimo, se puede. Sí, sí, tienes, sí. tienes ahora, tienes oh. ahora. No le gusta manejar. <ríe> eh, no, no manejar. Eh, pues es que lo que pasa es que sí, sí, o sea, eh, creo que ese es el tema. Eh, con esta aplicación creo que voy a hacer algo más productivo en el, en el retorno, ¿verdad? Ya de regreso, en la ida. Uh -huh. A veces me ponía, bueno, cuando no estaba estudiando ahorita me, pues me hacía cualquier otra cosa. Eh, estaba en el tráfico de los chorros, por decir algo. Pero uh -huh. ahorita que me pasó esta aplicación, pues yo creo que, o la, la página, voy a meterle con todo a esta parte. ¿verdad? Ojo, una por semana, no se, no se exaspere, agarre una okay. por semana. Y tranquilo, despacio, hasta que se le quede. Y va okay. a ver, va a ver, bien fácilmente se le van a dar las cosas, primero Dios, ¿ok? Ok. Bien. Thank you. Nos vemos mañana. Good night. Gracias, gracias. Good night, teacher.